And three, two, one, action. So this is the PES power box. It's a very simple unit to use. You always start off with your coarse and your fine at 1, your pulse and your frequency at 10. These are power interrupts. When the box, you turn the box on on the side, and lights up these nice bright LEDs to adjust for, for someone to feel it. Typically, this is the one they're going to adjust first is the power. Most of the time they're going to get to about 8 or 9. And then you have the frequency, or the fine, sorry, the fine power, which is going to be a more subtle adjustment of the course. So it's going to make a slight change to the way it feels. It's very subtle. You have the frequency, which most people are going to usually find they like between 8 and 4. But the lower it is, the rougher it is, the higher it is, the smoother it is. On the side of the box, there's a dial that also affects the frequency. You roll it upward for a rougher sensation, downward for a smoother sensation. And then you have pulse, which obviously is very visual as to what it does. And then you have the power interrupts. As long as it's held down, the power is off to that channel. That's just the basics of how the box itself runs. To connect the box, you need a set of leads that, of course, are tied in a knot. Set my box down for a second. These are your low-profile leads. These are unique to our company, to PES. We manufacture this lead in specific because of the way our products are all put together. You have two ends that connect to electrodes and one end that plugs into your box. So this end plugs into the box. These connect to an electrode. This is considered what we call a double pole electrode. So you would connect both of these using the leads that you pinch and release as my leads don't want to go on my product today and pinch and release and there you have a successfully hooked up electrode all plugged in and connected ready to be used